One week from today marks the first day of school for Pitt County and many other counties here in the east. While it's a time that brings an array of emotion to light, like nerves and excitement, the cost of school supplies has risen amid inflation concerns, according to Daddy Assembly, mounting emotions of dread. Mayor Morgan joins us live now in the studio to break down what parents need to know when prepping for the upcoming school year and a new local program developed by a student wanting to help out. Hey, good morning, Mary. Hey, yeah, good morning, Jason. With the rising cost of groceries and everyday needs, families are looking for any break that they can get. I spoke to one Pitt County High School senior who's witnessed the struggles firsthand. He's now doing his part to relieve some of the financial stress for families when it comes to school supplies specifically. Shopping carts full of pens, pencils, and paper. All prep for the first day of school just around the corner for many. But the financial burden of preparing for the upcoming school year can be stressful for some families. Certainly the cost of school supplies has gone up. Data Assembly reports that one shopping cart full of only 15 typical school supplies items will cost you $60.41. And I know all the challenges it is nowadays with the rising cost of everything. And I don't think a parent should have to decide between food on table or school supplies. That's why Aiden Grifton High School senior Cameron Smith is taking action by starting the Supplies to Shine program. I initially got the idea from my mother. She's been a teacher here as long as I can remember. I decided that we're going to host a school supply drive and they can come and get it for free here at Open House. Parents and students will have access to items like binders, markers, and notebooks. Smith says his heart behind the program is to ensure the success of every student. It means a lot to me because education is the foundation of this country and you know I think for our country to continue moving forward, every kid has to have a great education, and that starts with school supplies, making sure they have what they need when they walk through the door. And Aiden Elementary School Principal Dr. Michael Casey looks forward to the impact Smith will have. Remember when I was a child opening up that box of crayons and uh, getting that glue stick out, and it really, it really warms my heart to see other kids have that type of experience that I had as a student with the school supply drive. Um, he'll have a lasting impact with these students. One student at a time. And the Supplies to Shine program at Aiden Elementary School is happening at the open house this Thursday on August 22nd. That's going to be from 4 p.m. to 6.30 p.m. And the first day of Pitt County Schools again is a week from today. That's going to be August 26th. Jason? Hard to believe is right around the corner. Crazy how fast the summer went, that's for sure. Too fast <laughs> to say the least. That's for sure. Thanks, Mary.